Hey, my legion, how y'all doing today? I want to talk to you about something that locally that happened. Uh, and it shows the power of social media. And this was from a guy named, uh, where is it, Tyler Carey. And he was at Franklin, he was at Franklin Area High School, uh, a high school in Erie County, you know. And uh, it held his graduation today, but one he was not there because he completed his requirements early and received his diploma to begin basic training for the Marine Corps. And he, like, uh, he had his caps and gown. He got a cap and gown, and he took photos with his family. One of those photos would be in my thumbnail. And before I go any further, I just wanted to say, uh, give a salute and wish you good luck. I was in the Army, not the Marines, but I'll tell you Semper Fi. That's the Marine Corps uh, logo. I hope you do uh, Marine, Corps, uh, Marine Corps motto. And I hope you do great, man. My best of luck to you. Well, anyways, the school dis the district did something uh, kind of rotten. Uh, he said that, uh, you know, his parents believed that their son would still be called at the graduation ceremonies just like the other students because, you know, they read a list of whole, whole students, but that wasn't true. They said the Franklin Area School District has a policy in place that if a student is not at graduation, their name will not be called, which is kind of bogus because he's leaving the service country and once again sometimes soldiers get screwed over and the school because of their policy they said they will not uh, announce his name which is complete bogus in my opinion and then what happened was his uh, dad was pretty upset when he took to this problem to Facebook and made a video oh that's why I, I, I didn't see the video though uh, he posted a video detailing the situation that spread quickly. 175 people viewed the video and was shared by more than 5,000 others in the United States, Canada, and even Japan. And notes of encouragement went to the, uh, carried over the problem. And then Shane Carey, one, just all he wanted was his son named recognized. And uh, after the video went viral, of course, the school caught up and said that his name will be announced. They buckled in the pressure. That was pretty rotten to them in the, in the, in, uh, the first place. And they had a video and his name was announced. And that's all he wanted. And then uh, Shane Carey said that uh, even though his name was announced, he said he believed the policy should be changed. And then, he, and then he's probably helping. Uh... Oh, and then it says Tyler has not heard of the situation because of restrictions on the base. But his parents sent a letter to him to tell him about the announcement back home. So that's good. But I mean, his father's still striving to... Uh, Make sure the policies change. Because that's pretty rotten. I mean, he's leaving the service country. His name should be called in the graduation. He completed his graduation early. His All his high school requirements early. He followed the rules. And he even got his cap and gown and stuff like that. And then he uh, got photos of his, fo uh, his folks, his parents. And uh, they weren't going to read uh, read his name at the graduation. But thankfully, because of the viral video, they, they did now. So... Justice has been done for uh, Tyler Carey. So I hope you like this video. It's, it just shows you the power of social media. Sometimes it helps, you know. So until next time, bye, please. Take care of my legion.